And they're off Milan, leaving from the outside. Lady Lind also trying to hustle away from the gate and miss if Hanover strides out smoothly for Jim Doherty and crosses over against the pylons to lead early. And Silver Springs with that inside advantage is right behind her, racing in second. Fifth on the inside is Forever Starlight. Getting rough at the back of the pack was Funny Malentine. Parked out in sixth, Blackberry Hanover, who finds herself third over right now. Moving up on the inside is Three Little Words. Congo Queen toward the outside. Second last is Armbro Blue Jay. Opening quarter in 28 flat. The inquiry sign has been posted. And way behind trailing the field is Funny Malentine as they head down the back stretch. And Missive Hanover is showing the way here. Parked out on the outside is Lady Lind, who's racing in second. Blackberry Hanover has gone off stride. Silver Springs racing in third. And Forever Starlet tips out and is well spotted. Second over for Dave Miller. Silver Springs going just enough to keep Lady Lind parked as they near the half mile marker. And Mile and chased up in traffic. Fifth on the inside. Congo Queen third over in the flood as they hit the half and 56 and four. Three little words looking to set up her late rally. She's fourth over with excess cover right now. Armbro Blue Jay slides past her at the rail with little more than three eights to come. Then the trailers, Funny Malentine and Blackberry Hanover and Miss of Hanover is now a length and a half clear. Lady Lynn starting to labor after a tough trip first over. So Forever Starlet is forced to move three deep a bit early on the outside. Silver Spring starting to lose touch from the pocket. Trapped in his mile in behind a wall of horses with nowhere to go. Congo Queen is sixth on the outside. Three quarters and 127 and four. Miss of Hanover leads it. She's two and a half lengths clear with an eighth of a mile to come. But here comes Forever Starlet who's charging hard on the outside. And Forever Starlet under a hand drive. Powers pass to the lead. Miss of Hanover back in second. Silver Springs racing in third. They're coming down to the finish. Pelling power strikes here. Forever Starlet and Dave Miller by two. Miss of Hanover with second and Silver Springs. Third. Miller drove both Blackberry Hanover and Forever Starlet in last week's limbs, and he picked the right one and did her tactical speed come in handy tonight. Miller allowed the speedy miss of Hanover to set the pace while he worked out a second over trip to add a Breeders' Crown title to this one's already impressive resume. From the first crop of 99 handball winners self-possessed, the winner gives Miller his third crown victory, all with trotters, the other two Magician and Cadabra. This is Brett Pelling's seventh crown victory, his first with a trotter. The winning owners have had a long string of top horses, including crown champions Expensive Scooter and Duke of York. Chasing tail, Dale, day for night, and Meadowlands pace winner Dream Away. Winning driver Dave Miller was impressed by his victorious filly. Yeah, yeah, the, the horse that run at uh, um, Doherty's filly, that, that made the race for us. I mean, the, the quick half going into the wind, uh, I, I know how tough that can be uh, in the second race that happened to me. And uh, it's just, I just worked out a good trip. I got a second over trip, and uh, she fired real good off her cover. Your second over coming into the stretch. You still had a couple lengths to make up, though. Yeah, but she felt real good. I mean, I, I was pretty pretty sure uh, I was going to get there. She felt very strong, and I uh, hadn't asked her at all yet. 